Hey everybody, welcome back to the Philly Picker YouTube channel. My name's Joe. I appreciate everybody stopping back and checking out another video. Today's video, I'm going to go over um, the sales that I had on eBay Tuesday into Wednesday morning. Um, I sold six items for a total amount of $736.23. The best part of these six sales they all took place while I was sleeping. By the time I went to bed on Tuesday night, and when I woke up on Wednesday morning, these were the sales that I had. It was a great feeling waking up to that. Um, to be honest, I never had, I never sold that many uh, things overnight before. So, if you are new to the channel, I am a part-time reseller here. I'm located in uh, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. I do most of my uh, sourcing at garage sales, estate sales, thrift stores, things like that. Um, some of the items that I have uh, that I sold on Tuesday, there was one high ticket item, um, which was a great sale. It was actually something that I ordered online. I posted it once to the confirmation. Uh, once I received the confirmation after I ordered it, I posted before I even received the item and it sold um that night so let's get into it first up i have this um cordless phone set it's a bag of cordless phones here it's eight at&t uh, model number is cl eight two four six three um it's four ha four handsets and an answer machine um I had these in the store with a 10% sale going on. Uh, they sold for $35.70 with free shipping. I have $3 into these, and I picked these up at a uh, garage sale uh, probably about a month or so ago. So overall, that was a good sale. I'm happy with that. Next up on the list that's going out, I have this, uh, it's a Cabbage Patch Clown. Here's his hat here. He goes, it's a Bashful Billy Cabbage Patch. I picked this up at the Goodwill for $5. It ended up selling for $64.98 plus shipping. Next up, I have the Seattle Seahawks Fitted Baseball Hat. It's new with tags. It's a size 7 and 3 eighths. And it also has the, um, the ear flaps that go down. Um, I picked this up at a garage sale uh, over the summer. I paid a dollar for it. And it ended up selling for $36.73 with free shipping. This was actually the item that I was talking to you about that sold before I even received it in the mail. These are a brand new pair of Nike Air Force Ones. They were released on Monday, and the only way to get them, I believe, was through the Nike app. I was able to get a hold of a pair. Um, they retailed for, you can see it on the front. $250. I had these, I listed them before I even received them. And um, I listed them for $475 with free shipping. Uh, a buyer sent me an offer for $450 and I accepted it. Uh, next up were these, these are 1,000. They're called Kids Fitness Toe Tokens. I think uh, schools give them out for uh, when kids accomplish something with uh, during their um, gym classes and stuff like that. So I'm not exactly 100% sure what they are used for. I think they make like bracelets out of these. They're actually small feet, if you can see on plastic feet. Um, I picked these up at a, um, I actually picked up two bags of these from a um, garage sale a few months ago. I paid $2 for them. 
I sold them for, I had them up for $29.98. Somebody offered me a, uh, somebody sent me an offer for $28 plus shipping. Next item up is one of those things that I always look for once I go out to uh, garage sales or state sales or yard sales, even flea markets. It's uh, baseball bats. I always look to pick up uh, baseball bats, softball bats, baseball gloves, anything like that. They always seem to sell good, even with the uh, baseball season being over up here in, in Philadelphia. I was uh, this still sold. So um, this is a Louisville Slugger TPS. It's a slow pitch softball bat. I picked this up at a flea market for five dollars. And I ended up selling this for $98.97 with free shipping. Overall, it was a good feeling to uh, essentially make money while I was sleeping. Um, like I said, it was six sales for a total of $736.23. Um, that's going to do it for this video. I appreciate you guys stopping back and... Uh, Check it out in another video. If you did like the video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Also, please feel free to critique me in any way. I know I don't have the best quality videos. I am just starting out. I do film everything on my iPhone. I do all my edi editing on my iPhone. Um, so I am learning as I go along with uh, each video. So hopefully, as time goes on, you guys continue to stick by my channel, and I hope somebody out there is learning just a little bit some, just a little bit of something from each one of my videos. Thanks again. Have a good night. I'll see you in my next video.